Timothy Wambuga is a selfless, gifted and an all-round teacher of Wasesa Mixed Primary School in Bugweri District. When Timothy joined the school six years ago, he formed agricultural groups which are comprised of teachers and pupils. He trained these groups to manage a number of projects like goat rearing and gardening. Part of the food produced is used in the school feeding program. Timothy's agricultural projects have not only improved the school's feeding program, but also helped to enrich the community food basket. Apart from training pupils and teachers at the school, he also trains parents and other community members on how to practice agriculture on their limited land. The new innovation which I brought here is to train children so that after here, they don't be job seekers, like rearing birds, like growing simple crops, using the simple land which they have at home. Because as you see, this is like a semi-urban area. We don't have very big parts of land. Timothy has made the school a second home for pupils through interactive learning and talent development. His innovations enabled his school win the district competitions in music, dance and drama on top of sports. Over the years, he has been recognized as best class manager in his school and his head teacher is proud of him. Mr. Wambuga is really an exemplary teacher. In fact, he has even won awards within the school. In one year, he was the best class manager. He has a heart for the child. There was a child who was unable to get lunch at school, and the child was sickly. Mr. Wambuga gave up his lunch for the child so that the child could perform so well. Children like him so much. He's a teacher who cannot sleep if he has something to accomplish in class. The programs he started have attracted a number of new pupils and reduced on the school dropouts. Children who used to miss school because of hunger and frustrating results now report early to school assured of lunch, lively learning and a great deal of co-curricular activities. Because before introducing such, we had very few children at this school. But now the community know that we train the, their children to be self-sustaining individuals in the future. So they interest us with the, their children. They, even the community members come here and learn how to use the small piece of land they have. And we have a good relationship between the school and the community. And as the children go back, they teach their, their parents and guardians at home. 